I'm from New York. I play for Pace Bootlegger Club. And I'm here at the Olympic and Paralympics Training Center. I'm super excited. I'm super stoked to get this opportunity to take you guys through my weekend. Uh, this weekend, I'm really excited to see all my friends that live on the West Coast that I don't get to see a lot. Um, I don't really get to see them a lot, and it's super cool to like have a place that you guys get to look forward to to meet up every few months, every every few training sessions. You get to see people you don't get to see every day, and it's super cool to meet up with them, catch up, talk and stay in touch and have something to look forward to. Today we don't have a training series, but we get to, we have a meeting tonight, and later today, food is always something that we all really look forward to. So I think right now we're all about to go grab some lunch in the, in the food court downstairs. I'll catch up with all you later. I'm gonna go grab some food, then I'm gonna go check into my room. I'll see you all later. Got a good meeting from Charlie. I uh, went back to the forums, hang out with a couple of friends. It was super chill. We were just kind of trying to lay low, get ready for the session today. Uh, my roommate was really nice. It was nice to meet him. And it was super cool to like, it's his first time, so it was super cool to share my NTP experiences with him. Kind of share with him some sort of tips and tricks on like what to do, what not to do, and what's the best time to show up at places. So it was super cool to have a good interaction with him. Uh, breakfast this morning was really good. My favorite part was probably the fresh squeezed orange juice. Oh, it's really good. Uh, open from 6 to 10, so I, you gotta get down there because there's always a long line for it. And they always run out of oranges, so they keep refilling it. But you gotta get down there and make sure you get like three cups and you carry it back to your table. Uh, today's session, I'm excited to compete. Um, it's like super, super like the energy in the room when we're all competing against each other. It's much different than back home because it's such a high level of volleyball and obviously everybody's competing for a spot in the U19 Worlds team. So the energy in this room when we're all competing at that highest level is super, super competitive and something I look forward to every day. Today my focus is going to be purely on my attitude. The first few sessions are more technical work and more passing work. So keeping your teammates up after they make a technical error or a tactical error, um, it's super good to make sure your team is up and if they make a passing error, like mentally, if they make a passing error mentally, it's like where they take the biggest hit. Because anybody can fix their technical work, but mentally, if you get sent out of the game passing, then you never, it's really hard to get back in. So it's important to keep them in the game. I'm gonna go stretch and warm up for my session today. Thank you all for coming with me. Um, with the altitude from Colorado Springs and the time change from New York. Um, the time change and the, the combination of the two kind of really knocks wind out of me. It's really hard, especially at this high level volleyball. Um, I'm not really used to, so it's like really adjusting to it is a challenge for me, but like the first session is also good mentally because then I like to kind of learn like what I'm struggling with, what I need to adjust for, and it just makes me better for the next session. Really, it's kind of motivational, I would say, like in the competitive drive sense because um, you see all those guys and I want to do what they do and I know I can so I push myself to be like just as good if not better and like to climb the rankings and to be the guy that everybody's like looking at or looking up to for the younger kids. Um, so seeing all these, seeing all like the top players in the country and just having like that bar, like the level that you need to work towards and have to achieve, it's really good to um, get like a mental state of mind like where you need to be. Today, the most I'm looking forward to is really the next session. Like um, after today, like we, first session is always kind of more technical and then you compete more second session. So I'm ready to compete. I'm super hyped for the second session. I'm ready to get into it. Good morning, it's Noel Maybon. I'm here for the third session, just stretching out. I'm getting ready for a good day today. I'm super hyped, ready to play, ready to compete. Today as a whole, I'm most looking forward to the second session, getting to do some more gameplay. Um, so we got two more sessions today, then one more tomorrow. And tomorrow's the latter day. So today is really just preparing to get, preparing for the latter day um, to compete against the best and best teams. So it's like trying to get into that gameplay mentality. Um, just like more, more like game, I need to score mentality instead of like the focusing on technical work. 
and I feel like I play better in those situations, so I'm hyped to get started. Uh, the rest of yesterday was good. It was really smooth for me, and um, it was super cool. At the end of the day, when we were doing a bunch of play work, I was playing against Blake. I had some nice blocks and some nice kills, and I'm hyped to do it again. Uh, two focuses for myself today. Um, yesterday was my attitude. Today I'm going to go more towards my block. I got beat a lot line, which is more of a, it's a mental adjustment, just starting myself out farther, but still helping on the middle and closing out to that pin and pressing over. And then my second one's going to be serving because serving is the only aspect of volleyball where you can control it all yourself. So I think it's going to be super good if I focus on my serve because um, that's the only part of the game that you can control. So if I can control that, I can control other aspects of my game as well. Catch up with you guys after practice. Thank you all for coming with me today. Thank you all for watching and listening. See you guys. Yo, Roman, cut part. I'm mic'd up. I'm mic'd up. This is my boy Blake Fishelbert. Oh. How do you say your last name? Hey, Paul Bursch. Fresh off an injury. He's coming back. He doesn't want to participate in the bounce cop. He don't jump high enough. I introduce you. Introduce yourself as a contestant uh, in the I'm, bounce cop. I'm Joel Ennis. Yeah. Where are you committed? Uh, I'm committed to Grand Canyon and uh, from Virginia Beach. Yeah, he not winning. <laughs> El Aura, I introduce yourself for the bounce comp. Oh, uh, my name is Jeremiah Aro. What club you play for? Uh, Ultimate from Chicago. And are you gonna win the bounce comp? Probably not. El Aura. El Aura. El Aura, Dante. Wait, am I allowed to swear? I'll stop. <laughs> my fault. My fault. Can I consent? Nah, I was. I was saying some, I was just making sure. To the pen, to the pen. This was... I'm for sure winning right now. I don't even think it's really close. Um, like, they're hitting waffles. I'm hitting straight down, I got 43 inch vertical. There's no comp. <laughs> I'm getting the offer off the bounce comp. <laughs> right now, I'd say my biggest comp is probably either Grand or Coop. You ready? All right, hey, introduce yourself. Hey, introduce yourself. Go first. Go first. Introduce yourself. Both of you. Uh, introduce. I'm Cooper Keen from California. So. Hermosa Beach. All right, and I'm Grant Lamar from uh, North Carolina. All right, this is the bounce comp right here, this final round. All right, two each, two each, two each. All right, y'all got to rate two the bounces. It's right, two, right, 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 right. two each between us three. All right, this is his first one. Out of 10, out of 10. Dante, Dante's ref, out of 10. That was a good, that was a good seven. Seven? Six. Bro. Seven, six, all right. Easy first round dub, man. Not even close. That's not even close. Uh, looks like we're over. That's a dub. Undefeated bounce competition champion. Hi, it's Noel Maymai. I just finished up my last session. Uh, great session today. My team went eight and four. It was a really good session. We beat top team and we we're on top court for a little bit. We fought back. We were kind of like the underdogs, so it felt good to keep winning against those bigger teams. Um, something I'm definitely going to take away from this camp and bring back to my game is uh, more of the swing deep mentality. I think um, back home, I always try to swing more down than deep. And against bigger blockers, you can't do that, so I need to start practicing it more. And the uh, swinging deep and the swipes are utilized or underutilized where I'm from. And <laughs> it are better utilized against those bigger blockers here. So I need to bring that home and keep practicing it to practice for camps like this and for bigger blockers and eventually in college. The last thing I really had to say is like at the NTDP camps, it's like you really got to bring your all. We did activity at the end where you raised your hand and then coach told you to raise it a little bit higher and everybody had a little bit more in them. 
and I feel like I can bring that home too. Because um, the biggest thing from these camps is you always got to take something away and you want to bring it back home. Because not everybody has the opportunity to come to these camps, but everybody has the opportunity to learn that curriculum in these camps. So I got to take home as much as I can and I got to teach it to everybody. And these deep swings and the giving a little bit more and the swipes and the technical work on your passing, being firm, is something I can take home and I can teach you a bunch of people that don't know as much. And it's just really important to take away and share with as many people as you can about these amazing camps. Thank you for following this weekend. It was a great weekend. I had a great time. I'm really excited for the opportunity to do the takeover and the interviews. I was really stoked to do it all. Um, you can find me on Instagram, um, noah.mabon21, or on my volleyball page, Noah Mabon Volleyball, VB2026. Um, thank you all for coming. Have a great rest of your day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.